The Coast Guard has begun to modernize our outdated networks and information systems into a capable and resilient enterprise mission platform that we invest in and operate like our fleet of cutters, boats, and aircraft. We must do this to enable us to operate today and prepare the service for the future. Every investment going forward, starting with the service-wide migration to Windows 10, to the transition to the joint information environment, will fit into a vision that links our investment and sustainment in IT to requirements. Like many others, for decades the service sought the opportunities that technology promised without an understanding of the new risks. We took an administrative system and networks designed to support daily office and business functions, and today we rely on it as our primary platform to conduct and enable most operations and mission support functions. This approach has overburdened our networks with a glut of daily demands that it was never designed to support. The result is a collection of network systems and applications that are not reliable or resilient and not anchored to discipline requirements. The enterprise risk is significant. We're really doing the continuous damage control, struggling daily to combat the equivalent of fire and flooding in the engine room, while the adversaries attempt to inflict further damage and the mission demands increase. We will modernize our enterprise mission platform. The Coast Guard has begun that effort, and it's critical to our future ability to operate at sea, in the air, and on land.